Today we're recording the climb from Albatera to Honden, which was used in the 2011 Vuelta de España. Climb is approximately 11 kilometers, starts in the town, relatively flat but gradually rising as we go further up the mountain. One kilometer and we're passing through a lot of fruit trees on either side of the road, pomegranates, oranges, lemons, as we may make, make our way up into the mountain. Kilometer two and we're gradually rising up. Kilometer three and from this point on it starts to rise. leaving civilization behind and making our way to the slopes of the mountain. Kilometer four and up we go. Now approaching the crossing of the Canal of Albatera, which is approximately three kilometers from Costa Cycling. Kilometer five and approaching a false flat before it kicks up again. Kilometer six and we drop into the valley before we rise up quite dramatically. Kilometer seven and now the serious stuff starts. and now we have to contend with some serious pens as well as the rise in the land. Approaching 13% climb, which is 13% average, um, in parts rising to approximately 20%. The parts I hate the most. <laughs> the sign says 10%, but I can assure you it's far more than that. Falling rocks in this area, make sure you wear a helmet. Really bad bends here, especially with big lorries coming down from the quarries. This next corner, Chris and Gurley's corner, by some visitors from Northampton who failed to get up here and had to walk. Um, took them many attempts before they were able to do it. No names mentioned, but his first name's Stuart. This is where Juan Antonio Fletcher had to have a push by some spectators in last year's Welter. Kilometer 10 little bit of a flat before it kicks up again. Another batch of 13%. Really difficult to go with the bends as well. in the summit before we drop away to uh, down into the valley of Pondon. It's kilometre 11 which marks the end of the climb. Kilometre 12 approaching the outskirts of the town of Honda. And that's it, back on flat ground again. This is Hoffman. 